we're uh, seeing the second company at 500 startups, it's 300 MG, and they uh, are taking advantage of all these new cloud work services, these collaborative services that you're gonna hear a lot more about this summer from Google and other people. But they help you keep your email box clean by having a, a place to watch what's being updated by your coworkers, and it's really cool. So who are you? I'm Mark Kaufman, I'm CEO and co-founder of 300 Milligrams. Uh, and, and we do uh, dashboard for all your cloud uh, services. Rocky and I mm -hmm. just saw a cloud-based video editing system, right? So we're now working in the cloud. We have Facebook for telling our friends our new photos and our new videos that we upload, but we don't have a really good system for working together. And I, I find that interesting. What are you guys doing to solve the, the problem of having all these weird services that we're working on together? Yeah, th that's, that's exactly the problem that we're going into. Uh, and, and it's not just weird service. Actually, there are a bunch of services which are very good and very useful, which we use every day. And uh, with the cloud, the problem is that it's so easy to build a new product to solve this specific small problem that there will be so many of them which you have to use every day. So your business information is basically scattered around the whole the world, <laughs> like whole the cloud. So what you want to do is get one space where you jump into that in the morning, open that, and you get everything which is important for your work at this one place. So you can search your business information, you can collaborate around that, you can organize it, no matter where those things are actually residing. And you, you guys, give me a sense of all the services that mm -hmm. you you work with, like Google Docs mm -hmm. and spreadsheets. Google and Dropbox. Docs, Dropbox, uh, Salesforce, Box, uh, like Box.com now, uh, it's 37 signals. So all the services which you use to be more productive at work. And that's what our show's about. It's uh, small teams, mm -hmm. big impact. We're trying to help people become more productive so that they can have a bigger impact in the world. Um, give me a sense of what you would see on your screen when, you're, when you switch to using mm -hmm. uh, 300 MG. So the key navigation element uh, in 300 milligrams is your newsfeed. So you see everything what your team or your colleagues are working on aligned uh, into the timeline. So if, for example, somebody is doing the video right now, it, it will pop up in the stream. Somebody is writing a Google document, it will be there. And so it's a great way to get catch up, like, okay, that's what's happening right now in my team, and here are the things which I need to pay attention into. Yeah. So in some sense, uh, from usability perspective, you can think of, it looks similar to Facebook, where you have newsfeed, and then wall pages for each document or for each work item which, you're work, which you are involved in. It's similar, actually, to the Google, when you go to Google Docs, you see a list of all your Google Docs, but that doesn't include your Dropbox, it doesn't include uh, your Box.net, exactly. it doesn't include your <coughs> exactly. Salesforce. So, so like each individual tool has pretty good usability to jump around uh, things in this tool, but that's not how you want it to be. You want to have everything what you're working on in one place. So and that, that's what we do. We bring all your work items into one place, allowing you to be faster and more productive. Now, this doesn't compete with a social feed like Salesforce Chatter or um, uh, Yammer, for instance, mm -hmm. right? Uh, those are for telling each other what you're thinking or what you what, what's interesting yeah, it's, to you. Yeah, it's very different. Even though it might look uh, similar that they also have the feed, but uh, our feed is about work items, like documents, tasks, sales opportunities, and their feed is about what people say at work. It's also very useful and there's lots of social interaction at work but we take as a key component the work what you do and, yeah. and that's what is central point in our case. Are you heading toward almost a project management or a task management because let's say I'm developing mm -hmm. a product right I need the hardware to be done I yeah. need the software to be done I need the box to be done I need the press release mm -hmm. to be done I need the advertising ca campaign yeah. to be done and each of those some different team is working mm -hmm. on that or some different person. Is there a way to say, you know, when this is finished, let me know so I know it's it's done or let me know the status of what it's in? Uh, y yeah, that's, <laughs> that's a good question. So one of the things, and actually it's one of the most requested features also from our users is 
let me tie things from different cloud services into one bundle or into one mini project I'm working on right now so I can have this customer account, this Google Doc is related to that, and there's specific product feature if you are developing something. And let me discuss that in one place. Let me follow the updates about that I in one item. So I, that I is definitely where we are going to. Cool. I, I think I'm uh, asking similar question, but more on workflow, mm -hmm. because like if, if I'm waiting for Rocky to edit a video, I need to know what pro uh, whether that video has been finished or not. Mm -hmm. Not that he's opened the video okay. or not that he's editing the video, but that it's been actual, that he signed mm -hmm. off and said it's finished. It's more workflow related. Uh, yeah, so today there's not so many things about especially the workflow, but as a, that, that's the first thing which comes to your mind, like as the next uh, innovation that we can do. First of all, you brought all the data together and then you start improving the workflow because you have joined those things together. Yeah. How are you building a business mm -hmm. around this? Because uh, it does, it's not clear to me how this yeah. is going to be a business. Uh, it, because it's productivity it's a tool, we can actually charge <laughs> people to, for being productive at work. And in that sense, we are in a better position than social tools out there which can't charge their users. So uh, there is clearly a freemium model in that, so you can get key functionality for free. And uh, as soon as we launch the premium accounts, you will be able to upgrade to be like even more productive, and then you have to go, uh, yeah, and pay five bucks, ten bucks per month, depending on the yep. depending on the plan you use. Since we're coming to 500 startups and seeing companies like yours mm -hmm. at the end of the process of going through this incubator, mm -hmm. um, what's what's the last week been like for you after after the demo day? Yeah, it's crazy. We <laughs> we talk a lot to journalists and potential investors, to potential partners. So it's uh, yeah, it's basically it's all the time outside the office, and uh, w which is in some sense very good, in some sense bad because you, you've made lots of friends here and you want to last days to talk to them also. Yeah, but it's most of, most of the time right now is on the meetings. Cool. Do you, since you're talking to people who are thinking of joining an incubator, mm -hmm. you know, what's uh, one tip for the next class, the next group of entrepreneurs who are going to mm -hmm. come and hang out with Dave McClure and, and uh, go through this incubator? <laughs> that's good. Uh, do something cool, something interesting. That's probably, uh, there are lots of hacks of how you could get in, but first of all, do something which is needed by users and uh, interesting. And then, uh, yeah, try to get into the network, try to, um, to learn what people are interested in what they want, and then, then people will start recommending you into this network. Very cool. Th that's probably the easiest way to get in. Very cool. Uh, what, where do we learn more about you guys? 300.mg yeah. is our website. And you're on Twitter and Facebook and the usual places? Yeah, everywhere. 300 milligrams on Twitter and Facebook. You just search for the name and find our page. And yeah, very <laughs> that's cool. very easy. Well, thanks yeah. so much for spending a few minutes with me. Thank you.